everyone and welcome back to my channel. Sorry that I am in a different location today but Edward is asleep next to me and I needed to get a video filmed and I couldn't leave him on his own so we'll just have to go with it. So today's video I thought I would just do a quick little update on how Edward is doing at the moment. He is now 13 months old and he is changing every single day, doing new things and saying new words and he's just such a funny little guy, like he's just hilarious. So yeah, so at the minute he is napping, at the moment he tends to have one big nap during the day and that tends to be in the morning after we have come back from the school run up to any time just before lunch and he tends to have about an hour and a half two hours and then that will t normally tide him over until bedtime which he is sleeping better at night but he is going down any time between nine and half ten which it is late but it's it works for us and sometimes he goes before that, sometimes he just won't. It just depends what he has been doing that day and how active he has been. He still won't self-settle in his cot. He lies with us and then we transfer him into his cot, which I'm pleased to say he has been staying in all night for the past three weeks. We recently bought him a toddler pillow and duvet set I didn't even know that they did them we were just in next and I saw them and I thought you know what anything is worth a go as his sleep was just all over the place and he has been sleeping all night through he varies from getting up at six seven or on Sunday he got up at half nine in the morning and it just varies and we we'll just let him wake up naturally unless we have somewhere to be obviously the school room but he's just doing really well and he just looks super cute although he does look a bit too grown up when he is laid on his little pillow and his little duvet and he's just doing really really well with his sleep and I'm so glad that we are getting some more sleep as it had just got to an awful point where I just never thought it was going to end and I was just so shattered and I can't believe how tired that I was actually feeling. I didn't realise at the time but I was definitely feeling it whereas now I've just got a spring back in my step and sleep certainly does make a big difference to my mental well-being. So yeah, sleep is going all good. Um, eating is doing really, really well. He's such a good eater. We are so, so lucky. I don't know if it is because it's the third time round and we are just more relaxed. But he is just, whatever you give him, he'll at least try, which is amazing. And he's just doing really, really well. He tends to have wheat bix with whole milk for his breakfast. Then he will have a sandwich and some fruit for his dinner. And for tea, he will have whatever we are having. Or if that is not quite suitable for him, then we will make him something else. He loves omelets. He loves scrambled eggs. He loves pasta. He loves anything with fish. He loves vegetables just basically anything he will eat it he's just an eating machine he weighs 20 pounds now I took him to be weighed last week and he's still in 9 to 12 a month clothes as he's quite a short stock like me but he's all in proportion although the health visitor did say that his head is a little bigger than what she would like not like for his body but his head is quite big for his body length but he's always been on that centile he's on the 25th centile 
and she said it's not a problem as he's always been there um he just loves reading his books still and playing with his walker and his trains his garage and his toot toots cars but he is most definitely a bookworm he loves his dupler bricks and he will just sit there for ages emptying the box of bricks and just putting them back in the brick bricks in the box he loves going swimming still we're still swimming he's just got his next badge he loved baby sensory although we've had to finish that now as he has reached the age limit for that but he absolutely loves baby sensory and if you've got a baby i would definitely recommend looking into baby sensory where you are it's given me so many play ideas for him at home and he just loves it. He loves water play. We went out last week when it was really hot in the pool. He And he's just a very sociable baby. We go to play group and yeah, he's just such a dream. Like he has literally he just slots in wherever we're going with the older two. Obviously he comes with us. But he has just slotted into family life. He's just got a new stroller, which he really loves, like just watching the world go by. He is just a jolly little guy that just gets on with it. He makes everyone smile and everyone laugh. And he's just so funny. He's not so keen on being in his jumper room anymore, as he likes to be on the move constantly. He's not quite walking on his own, but he will walk with his walker or if you're holding his hands and he will cruise along the furniture, but he's just not got that confidence yet. The other day, I thought he may start walking as he let go of the settee and was stood there for like two seconds and then he realised what he was doing and he suddenly held back on and then sat back down and he but i'm sure he won't be long he has five teeth now he has the two at the top and the three at the bottom and he was really suffering with his teeth but that seems to have settled now he's just had his last lot of jabs before he has his preschool jab that'll be the next one but he's just had his MMR jab and all those ones and he's coped really well. And he had his birthday back in March and he had a lovely time. He ended up having a snow birthday as it was snowing and the kids had a snow day from school as it was really quite bad in the morning. But by the afternoon it thankfully melted and we went shopping. And then on the Friday, the day after, we took him to the farm which is what we had originally planned to do on his birthday. So yeah, if there's anything else in particular that you would like to know about him, then do leave me a comment and ask your specific questions about him. But he's just doing really well. I've not done an Edward update for a while, so I thought I would just film a quick one now while he's having a nap as I can no longer film with him around as he's just so noisy, so full on and he does not sit still for two minutes. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more. I upload on a Monday and a Friday at 7pm and I would love it if you could stick around to the channel as I just love getting new subscribers and love all my old subscribers i really love how my channel is growing and we will see you next time